Hi everyone, welcome to my channel. This is the Zumo robot for Arduino version 1.2. Fully assembled and it comes with some uh, micro, I guess, metal gear motors. The gear ratio on this is 75 to 1. And I bought this from Adafruit, but you can buy this directly from Pololu. This is the older version. There's a newer version, I guess, that um, it can actually balance itself on its two wheels. Gyro circuitry that comes with it. Let's take a look at this one. It's pretty small. And it's essentially a shield for Arduino. Uh, instead of the shield plugging into the top of the Arduino, you just take your Arduino, Arduino Uno, and uh, plug it in upside down like that. So I did see in the Arduino IDE there is a sketch, a line following sketch for this Zumo robot. So I'm going to see if I can load that sketch onto this Arduino Uno and um, see if this will follow a line. It's got the circuitry here for the sensors that will enable it to follow I guess a black line on a white background. I wonder if you can then go into uh, the sketch and change that so it could be say it was a, a chalk white chalk outline or maybe asphalt. It's pretty it's got this bulldozer type of blade in the front here and there's maybe I don't know an eighth inch of clearance there so has to be a pretty smooth surface. So here it comes with these nice rubber tracks. And it has a battery compartment for four AA batteries. So let's load the sketch onto this Arduino Uno and see if I can get this thing working. All right, so to get started with the Zumo, you need the library imported into your Arduino IDE. I thought I did that already, but I did not. So there's a couple of options here. If you go to GitHub, uh, you can get the library and I used to be able to used to have to unzip the library and then rename the folder and then take that folder and copy and paste it into the library folder um, wherever you had installed your Arduino IDE so now what they have is if you open up your um, Arduino IDE you can go up to tools is it tools or sketches? Sketches include library. And you can either, if you download the zip file from GitHub, you just add uh, .zip library and point this to your desktop or whatever. See so if you click on that. Um, yeah, you just, you know, keep track of wherever you download that zip file. And this will do the rest once you uh, select that file. Uh, but it's already included, so sketch, library, you go to manage libraries, open that up, and you can do a search, Zumo, and here we have the Zumo Shield, Arduino library for the Palulu Zumo Shield and Zumo Robot Kit for Arduino. So select that and it says uh, you select install 
Now here's this one here is the uh, the newer version of the robot. So this is the one that I have. So I say install, and it's installed. So close, and now if I go over to sketchbook, we have examples. We go over to examples here. Let's see what we have. Zumo Shield. Okay, so now I have the Zumo Shield and all these examples. So here's the line follower. We've got a border detector, compass, line follower, maze solver, push button example, uh, Q. TRA example. I don't know what that is right off the bat. RC control, sensor calibration, sumo collision detect, zumo buzzer example, zumo buzzer example two, three, and zumo motor example. So what I want to do is take the line follower and there it is and what I can do is verify see if this verifies it's taking a while come on all right, no errors. So now I want to plug the USB cable into my Arduino Uno. And I want to install that sketch. So now I can disconnect this. and plug my Arduino Uno into the Zumo Shield. Make sure I have this oriented correctly. Can't really go any other way. It's gonna be, let's see how easy it is to line up all these pins here. So be real careful here. All right, so that's how that sits there. So all I have to do now is to add four AA batteries. And right here. Is there an on off switch? Oh, yeah, right here. A little tiny on and off switch. So, what I've done is I took a four by eight sheet of plywood and laminated it with white laminate. But I was just thinking I have, I don't know if it's too, too small of a surface area. I have a whiteboard. Um, what I did is I purchased this tape here. It's four whiteboards. So people want to like create some, some chart or some tables. And um, I've got, it was a, a sorted pack here. Let's see what these are. I don't know. I think it was less than a 
Well, it might be a quarter of an inch. So I was going to put this on the laminate to make a track. Oh, that doesn't look like a lot there, but maybe I can just uh, try it real quick on the whiteboard I have right here. So this is the relative size of the zoom out to the whiteboard. So let me take that tape and make a little loop and see if the Arduino with the Zumo shield, the uh, Zumo robot, will follow that. All right, so there's a simple track. I don't know how sharper turn it's going to be able to detect for the tape there. Sort of difficult to make a little arc there with the tape. And, oh, I hope this doesn't uh, catch the blade. But let me turn this on and have it do its thing, see what goes on here. It's on. And it's just sitting. And is there a self-test? It's not doing anything. Hmm. Oh, there was a reset button there. I thought I'd give it a try. Looks like there might be some additional steps that need to be taken. Huh. Try that again. Whoa, there it goes. Hey! Wasn't certain anything was going to happen there for a second. All right. Taking those turns. I'm going to have to get some more of this tape to uh, make a track on a 4x8 sheet of uh, laminated plywood. And I'll try out some of those other sketches with the maze, uh, being able to navigate a maze. So this is the Zumo robot, or Zumo shield, for the Arduino Uno. And this is the line following program, or line following sketch, that is available in the uh, Arduino. Well, it's a Zumo library for the Arduino. Just need to install that into your Arduino IDE and uh, you'll have those resources available and you'll be able to upload those example sketches. So I hope you found this video interesting. Uh, please subscribe, like, and or comment. And thanks for watching.